Welcome or welcome back to Baldur's Gate 3, the Bard or also the Patch 8 playthrough. So let's go. Don't waste a step. We have an old bear yep. to seduce. Um, Tell me, Gail. Where, what is wait. your interest in the astral plane? Yeah. Time. Or rather, the absence of it. In the astral plane, everything is eternal. Okay. I really think. It will be my home soon enough. Should Vlakith will it. I actually think Gale wants to become a god of some sorts. Like, I don't know. Like, he really has, like, some narcissistic tendencies in a way. He's really full of himself. He's very charming. He's very charming. Um, he... Well, I don't want to, you know, I don't want to spoil anything. So if you don't want to know anything about Gale, um, skip ahead like a minute or so. I'm going to I'm going to wait a little bit so you can skip ahead. You want to skip ahead? Go skip ahead. I'm just walking. There's not anything going to happen now. So um, now, um, yeah, Gale. So he, he has been with a goddess like imagine imagine <laughs> imagine the the big aubergine energy you have to have yeah the big cojones you have to have to think you can seduce and be with a goddess or even did he summon her did he summon her to be with her i don't understand this well he he was like oh i'm this good so i'm gonna impress a goddess like <laughs> you know, he's just like, I'm gonna perform the most amazing spells, and then Miss Robo's just there being like, Hi. Hi. <laughs> like, what? I don't know. But still, I think he wants to be a god. Now he wants to be eternal. And he also says, like, the mortal, so he doesn't really. He's a human, but he doesn't... I think he doesn't feel like he belongs to the humans. I think he thinks he's something better. He's something um, upscale, you know? He's he's a step ahead of normal humans. And he thinks maybe that he um, deserves immortality and and eternity and, like, you know... Um, a goddess, but like the the, the goddess was like hell Look no, there, a shrine. Yeah, a shrine. <laughs> but there's magic keeping this chest sealed. Even, I can feel its aura. Even her was like hell no. Okay, now let me stop talking about it. So everybody who wanted to skip ahead can <laughs> come back. That stench, dead Albert prey, no doubt. Oh yeah, I forgot about this. Wait, you guys could stay here. If everyone else minds their business, oh my God, I'll be fine. Yeah, you guys can do that. Is that blood? No, never mind. Never mind. Let's in. see if we can seduce the old bear. That would be fun. Let's go up there. I really hope that if you're playing a bard and we will ever, yeah, we have a dragon in the game, that we can seduce it. I, I, I need Larian. I need Larian to put in the the bard meme seducing dragons. It's it's very 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 important to me. Okay, let's see. Oh shit. <laughs> Oh shit, Brianna and, and Hendrik were killed by the old bear. Jesus. Well, if they just run in, like like me. Something smells tasty. Oh my god. Something smells tasty. Oh my god, it's starting to stop. The element of surprise. Stop it, it's starving. Oh. Oh, no, 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 no. Albert eggshells. An unhatched one would fetch quite a prize. Oh, a starry nose. Who knows? How long will this take? 
A little bit. Let's explore. Okay. okay. With okay. every breath. There we go. Not a wizard, not a cat burglar. <laughs> okay, I think this is good. All's well that ends. Now let's not as bad as it could have. Let's go seduce an old bear, shall we? Hello, old bear. You feel the quake of its heavy Ew. footsteps before Ew. you see it. An owl bear. What its we... beaked face looming out of the darkness. Why do we have to look at the... Um... Oh, puff of your chest on roar. Hell yeah, let's do that. Um... Oh, the, the corpses? The pile of co corpses? Oh, why why the, like oh, zooming in? But I liked it. But ew. Ew. <laughs> Performance, let's go. Puff of your chest and roar. Uh, not if I should do that with the old bear. Boom. Fuck. Oh, the amount of times that I've <laughs> that I've rolled a goddamn one. What do you mean? Why? Ha! The beast returns the war in kind. Ooh -hoo -hoo. Okay, bud. Keep your blade close. Okay. Gently. Yeah, gently. You really should be gentle. What? How? I thought it couldn't see me. Excuse me? It didn't look like it could see me. Oh, that was... Oh, let's get this over with. Yeah, that was unfortunate. Very unfortunate. Let's shatter... The mom, not the cup. Oh, we cannot... Oh, this way we will just shatter the mom. Good one. No choice but to keep going. Lizelle. Stay out of sight. Out of sight, out of mind. I shouldn't linger. Yeah, because apparently you can't get close. Though it can't see us, but apparently it doesn't work. So, menacing attack. Boom. Amazing. Another fight. Let's go. Hell yeah. Okay, so. Uh, Bard. Let's see. Uh, do, 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 do. Dissonant Whispers. Let's go. Level 2 spell. It is distressed. Yeah, I can understand that. But you will die either way. Though, you know, we're walking into its lair. Into the old bear's house. With his cub and his egg, <laughs> and we're just like, "Fuck you," <laughs> and die, <laughs> which isn't very nice, is it? Anyhow, listen. Yeah, listen to me, As old bear. Head, you'll end in defeat. Hell yeah! <laughs> Please don't kill me. Oh, you're frightened. Oh shit! Screech! Screech! <laughs> Okay. Hi. Ooh. Oh god, the cub. Oh yeah, the cub's so astarian, I think. <gasps> oh god, we need to be careful. <laughs> I don't want to kill you, cub. Oh, I could miss the step. Okay. Um... Good. Time to push my luck again. Good, good, good. I don't have. Uh, guess we're gonna dissonant whispers again. Boom. Seven. Okay, cutting words. Pipe down. Note this trunk of lies. Okay. Maybe I should do that before Allow I. Me to demonstrate. Do anything. Uh. Wizard 
items. Okay, wizard. I'm gonna misty step. Gonna misty step. Can't go here, but I ooh, ooh, I can go here. So guess I can attack from here still. Uh, and turn frightened. That's good. Nice. A little old bear cub. I don't want to do this to you. So I'm not gonna do this to you. Uh, rogue. I have two. So I can dash. Ooh, ooh. How dare you? Uh. Uh. Can't do that, can I? No, of course not. I'm not. I'm. I'm not looking to 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 hurt you, old bear. Step quick. <laughs> ah, good one. <laughs> ah ha ha! What? Ah! Uh, oh. Come on! Don't let them see you bleed. Oh, Astarian. <laughs> Lying on the ground. Ah, oh, come on. <laughs> Get off. I will ascend. Oh. <sighs> well, the star and you're not gonna have a great time. Well, I can wait. No, I can't wait. Can you can you help him up? <laughs> no. No, I cannot. Well, anyhow. Well, I missed. That isn't fun. Uh, wait, yes. Wait, we can do this. Okay. Now. No, 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 no. I'm gonna pummel strike. Pummel strike the old bear cub. Break. Yeah. It is dazed. Hello. Move. Good. Now do it again. Good. Oh, why is Starian? Okay, I'm sorry, Starian. You're gonna have a bad time, but it's gonna be what it's gonna be. What? <laughs> okay, what the hell? Excuse me. Gale, 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 G Gale. Really? Really? Okay, maybe, maybe like this. Like this. There we go. That seems fun. Can I still jump? I can still jump. But because it's my bonus action. Yeah. Well. Then just go. Here, I guess. Go please, Mistra. Yep. Never a dull moment. Go, please, Mistra. Uh, wait, 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 wait. I actually want to use cutting words first. Yes, yeah, Shablucky. I agree. I agree. Now, Dissonant Whisper. Failed saving throw. Hell yeah, let's go. Also, I could use Healing healing Word. Oh, that sounds so beautiful. Bling, bling. Bling, bling, bling. A rough tempest I will raise. Yes, do that. Still frightened. Oof, oof. Oof, 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 oof. Oh god. Oh god, Astarian is beaten up. <laughs> beaten up. Okay, so. Oh. Great. Love that for us. Uh, okay. There's blood in the air. There is. Okay, um. Not enough movement. Oh, still. Okay. Boom. Okay, I have no movement whatsoever. Items. Heal yourself. At least a little bit. Because I guess you're going to get your ass handed to you. Oh, don't kill the cub. Do not kill the cub. Do you hear me? Of course. <laughs> yeah, you hear me. Great. Um. There we go. Tormentum. Boom, and you're dead. 
The cub looks from you to his dead mother. Thorian. A single strike will end his suffering. Aww. Let let the creature live. You watch speechless as the cub begins to eat his mother. At least the cub has a fighting chance now. That, or we've just prolonged its misery. No one back home will ever believe this. Maybe. Let's go loot them. Uh, scroll of whatever. Uh, short sword, scroll of grease. I'm gonna take that. Thank you very much. Always Give me this. For more? Yep. An owl bear egg. These are supposed to be worth a fortune. A fortune. There we go. Very well. Now, was that the pile? Where is the pile of corpses we saw? That was disgusting. I have no idea. Ooh, also. The pretty oak father's embrace. Eh. Encumbered, yep. Maybe, well, I think it's... It's medium armor, isn't it? Yeah, Gale isn't proficient Which in medium armor. Library? Nope. Is Astarian? <sighs> Everything looks new. No, he's not. Lizelle? Indolence breeds madness. Yeah, but hers is better, I think. Fifteen, yeah, hers is better. Uh, and me? Never a dull moment. Yeah, I'm also not proficient in medium armor, just light armor, as all three of us are. Ooh, also we still have the gruel, which is also healing, which is nice. So let's have a short rest and then group together again. Still alive. So yep. that's progress. Hell yeah. Breathe deep and move. I never sell sell the Obear egg, honestly. Never done that. Choo 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 choo. I mean of course an Obear egg. Is worth a fortune if you can raise your own all bear you know though it would also again if we Let's can get see. the all bear from act one into our camp and it grows over time and then we have a full-grown all bear at our disposal imagine imagine what we could do imagine what we could accomplish like Kazador move aside my all bear is gonna eat you <laughs> Okay, so now, thinking, what can we do? What can we do with a drunken say? Oh, I have an idea what we can do. <laughs> but maybe we're gonna do that in the next episode. Because I will need to do some heavy censoring. And today I don't have the time for that to do for, for this episode, which will come out on Tuesday the 12th of July. Um, when you're watching this because today while I'm recording it's my birthday <laughs> the 11th of July and I, I don't have time today to have you censor so we could try and pursue like maybe persuade I mean um, these goblins and tell them like F off or intimidate them look what we got here oh. another little birdie wanting to fly stop this thing okay <laughs> flap those wings some more and i'll feed you a worm funny that they took this animation out i thought it looked great and you hope you got a stomach for rights um, what the hell are you doing? What's it bloody look like? We're teaching this here pipsqueak to fly. Great. Uh, I wanted to fear. I just want to pass by. Let me rephrase that. Why are you doing this? Because it makes me laugh. <laughs> okay. Fun's over. Release the gnome at once. It does look funny, I'll admit. Mind if I stay and watch a while? <laughs> oh my god. 
Fonzova released the gnome at once. You want this little cave lurking what's it? Find your own. He's ours! The mark glows, but you feel nothing in response. Ooh. Your illithid power is beyond reach detect until you rest. Okay, detect thoughts. Read the goblin's mind. Fun. Okay, intelligence. I never done this. There we go. My luck is coming back, it seems. I ain't got much stomach for a fight. Better just put on a show and scare this one off. Okay. You don't have the stomach. Sh <laughs> yeah, you don't have the stomach for a fight. The goblin's nostrils flare as if trying to judge you through smell alone. We're leaving. What about the gnome? Ain't we supposed to bring him to... I said we're leaving! There's plenty oh, of sport Sandra. and rich pickings out oh, there for us! To Move it! Right, then. Okay. That was fun. Fresh meat. Scared meat. Yes! Why can you talk? Hello? Hello! I want to talk! Oh, it's gone. What's in here? Okay. A sheep's leg. Okay, let's free the gnome. Let's talk to the gnome. And then... Choo choo choo! Well... Break lever. Oh, I really... Um, I once played the evil playthrough, like my first playthrough on you YouTube for? is uh, actually an evil playthrough. Um, is there anything else? Well, a fish. A rotten fish. Which we can throw on somebody, I guess. Rotten fish, nice, thank you what very you much. For? <laughs> yeah, okay. Chill. I'm looting. <laughs> um, but yeah, I really, I really want to play uh, an evil, an evil playthrough again. I think the next one, the next one we're gonna do is gonna be another evil playthrough. It's gonna be fun. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come here. Something's on my mind. Cut me loose. Okay. What? What's? Uh, what's in for me though? <laughs> yeah. What's in for me? Free me and find out. Okay, free him. Hello. Oh, Maga Kamara. Those pustulant thugs. Well, get on with it. Get on with what? I freed you. A little compensation would be nice. You seem a little confused. You saved me. Now you'll extort me. That's how this works, yes? I'd rather know how you got caught. You owe me nothing. Yes, my reward now. I'd rather know how you got caught. Uh, my own fault, really. I should have dropped my pack and outrun those bastards. Alas. Take my pack, if you can find it. The only reason those goblins caught me was its weight. I'll travel lightly from now on. Okay. <sighs> Leave. Bye. Okay. Well, anything else? <laughs> um. <laughs> oh, I know what we're gonna do in the next episode. We're gonna definitely talk to the uh, ogre and the bugbear, right? Right here. We're gonna talk to them, but uh, I will have to heavily censor that, so you know. And um, then I think we're gonna go and get the um, the necromancy of Thai or Thay or whatever. <laughs> eh, I say Thai, I don't know. Uh, let's see. Oh my god, why is Gail's approval so high? Oh, you know what? We're gonna go into camp now and sleep a little bit. Oh, Lazelle has me. Why? And is Starin doesn't like me? Excuse me. Lazelle likes me medium. 
When I tried to romance Lizelle, that took so long. Well, I also tried to romance Shadow Art at the same time, and they mostly disagree disagree on everything. And Gale likes me too. Well, Gale is easy, I guess. <laughs> but still. God damn it. Okay, let's go and sleep. Yep. Let's see if anything happens. <sighs> no. And nobody even wants to talk. How sad. Yes. I don't even know if we even can romance uh, a Starian. How can I help? <sighs> You can't, apparently. Okay, nothing happened. How sad. Let's go sleep. Eat and sleep and fight. You don't sleep well, flitting between dreams oh, and shit. nightmares. Maybe you wake up because you know something is wrong. Or maybe you just get lucky. Shit. No, no, it's not what it looks like. I swear. I, I wasn't going to hurt you. I, I just needed, well, blood. There, in the dim firelight, you see him for what he really is. A vampire, a slave to sanguine hunger. Oh, damn. <laughs> oh, my, oh, Will in the background. Oh, I take everything back. I was like disappointed we didn't get anything and now we got blessed with a bite night. Oh my god, okay. Also, I like that we're not just... Well, do I like that? Yes, I, I, I do think I like that we don't just pick up a random steak. Because we know a Starian, right? We traveled with him. Well, he tried to bite us and attack us, but still, I like that we, we have the option to now just pick up a steak and lunch. At the Jesus at the monster, um, I can't believe I didn't see it. We even found the boar you snacked on. It's not what you think. I'm not some monster. I feed on animals, boars, deer, kobolds, whatever I can get. I'm just too slow right now, too weak. If I just had a little blood, I could think clearer, fight better. Please. Oh. The lithid push into his mind, searching for the truth. Oh, oh he's so slow. Oh. I don't care how uh, how much you need. You're not drinking my blood. Uh, push into his mind, searching for the truth. You focus on the source of the power, but it is quiet and still. It needs to rest. God damn it. No oh, tough one. <laughs> okay. Uh, why didn't you tell me? At best, I was sure you'd say no. More likely, you'd ram a stake through my ribs. No. I needed you to trust me. And you can trust me. Well, I don't think I would. But I understand that. I understand the fear. I understand the trust is the trust my god trust issues i can't talk the trust issues he has and that he believes the worst of people and rather is cautious oh i understand that okay yeah um i do i believe you you try to bite me how can i trust you leave if i ever see you again i kill you oh jesus i do i believe you thank you do you think you could trust me just a little further. I only need a taste. I swear. I swear. Fine, but not a drop more than you need. Really? I... Of course. Not one drop more. Let's make ourselves comfortable, shall we? It's like a shard of ice into your neck. A quick, sharp pain that fades to throbbing numbness. Your breath catches, your pulse quickens. Honestly, um, if, I, I think, if our 
um, uh, approval would be high enough. I actually would like him when he like bends over us, right? To make a sassy comment. To make like some jokey sassy comment. Like, ooh. But you know, just like, because it is, you know, it is kind of intimate, even though, you know, the, 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 the scary music, everything. But it, it is the way he like leans over. Uh, I would like him to say something sassy here. Um, I think it would it, it would suit his character to just make a comment about it. May but maybe he's just too um, too into now biting us, and he d he doesn't have a mind for anything else, no jokey mind. Then you know, just to bite us. Uh, that's enough. Persuasion. Yep. I think we're gonna... Oh my god. Grab the stake and drive it into his heart. Jesus Christ. Let him continue. No. Uh, persuasion. That's that's enough. That's enough, Asarian. Because I do like him telling us, like, you know. Um, it was amazing. Let's see. Bam, honey. There we go. Boom, boom, boom. Hmm? Oh, of course. That... That was... amazing. My mind is finally clear. I feel strong. I feel... happy. <laughs> I hate this! I hate this option! His guards down, grab the stake and drive it into his heart. What the hell? What the hell? I'm looking forward to seeing you fight. I don't. That felt wrong. No. <laughs> I'm looking uh, forward to seeing you fight. Shouldn't take long. So many people need killing. Now, if you'll excuse me, you're invigorating, but I need something more filling. <gasps> this is a gift, you know. I won't forget it. <laughs> Okay. You watch as he stalks towards the forest, stronger, more confident, ready to hunt. Oh my god. Oh, I love that we got it back. Oh, Scratchy is here too. Oh, I love that we got the this is a gift uh, back. Because before it was just, it, it didn't feel right. Because when when we saw the scene in uh, before patch seven, it was always you know this is a gift. So it made the whole bite night. It gave the bite night a different taste. You know, if we if you go through it, even though it's like kind of you know scary or whatever, and you go through it, and he says, "This is a gift, and I won't forget it." Um, it is definitely different than him just going away uh, like going and finding something else to drink because he can't kill you because then you know if he doesn't say this is a gift and stalks off it's just oh, I can't kill you because I still need you so bye bye but that's not his character I know that's what everybody wants to see in him and that's what they pr portray but it's not his character um same with Gale Gale isn't isn't the nice guy with a cat and everything. There is way more to him and like what lurks beneath. But that's the thing. I think Gale is showing nice but is evil in the inside and Asarian is showing, you know, evil and is like petting bunnies in the inside. <laughs> Let's talk to him. Hi. Good morning. How do you feel? I'm fine. Just a little Woozy. It'll pass. Just be glad I'm not a true vampire. A bite from them and you might wake up as a vampire spawn. Like my good self. All of a vampire's hunger, but few of their powers. Okay. Is that how you can stand in the sun? Because you're not a true vampire. Oh no. I should be cinders in this light. I hadn't seen the sun for 200 years before we crashed here. Someone, or something, wants me alive. They've changed the rules. 
Okay. Hi. Are you posing for a thumbnail? Are you looking at us? Um. Is he just like, uh, can you, can you please skip ahead? I, I don't want to, yeah, um, I don't. Oh. Oh. I like just looking at him. <laughs> okay, okay. Stare at us more. <laughs> Stare at us some more. We love it. We love it. <laughs> this is the uh, star and talks to you ambience POV, whatever. <laughs> okay. As for my other quirks, well, <laughs> we can figure those out in time. Oh, damn. <laughs> okay. Uh, if I can help, just ask. We're in this together. Figure them out quickly. I don't want any more surprises. What's causing this? The mind player parasite. Yeah, probably. Yeah, just if I can help, just ask. We're in this together. <laughs> you're such a sweetheart. I'm just glad you're being sensible about these uh, revelations. I was worried people might turn up with torches and pitchforks. Although there's still time. So we're traveling with a vampire, are we? Of course we are. A word of warning, Astarian. I taste absolutely awful. For his sake, he best not develop an appetite for Githyanki. Oh. Hi. <laughs> uh, enough. We still need him. Um, <laughs> this is just Astarian. Astarian staring. <laughs> for three hours straight. <laughs> Okay, enough. We need him, like it or not. I trust him. He won't hurt us. Uh, quite the opposite. I'm here in the spirit of openness and honesty to work together as a team. You said all the right words, but I'm not sure you mean the right thing. Still, I respect the decision that was made. There now. We're all friends again. Shall we go? There's a long day ahead of us. Yeah, that's the thing, though. Uh, we know he's not here for honesty and, and openness. He's not here for that. And that's why... Um, you, you might misread him. Th that's, that's my theory. You might res misread him. But because, yes, he's using the right words because he doesn't want to be, you know, uh, outcasted. But, uh, yes, he lies here. He, he, he is a terrible liar. You can see it in his face. Every time he lies, like, you know he's not being sincere. But there's moments when he is sincere. Uh, w wait, what, what is this? Will? Okay. Shadow. Why is Will? Will? Will, why are you? Well met. Leave. Are you now companion again? <laughs> why aren't you companion, Will? Okay, we'll, we'll have some issues. <laughs> the same that Shadow Art has. I guess you have to recruit him. Yeah, wait, he doesn't even have his tent up. Uh, well, we're going to do that in the next uh, episode, I guess. We're going to recruit Will as well. Um. Oh, also, do we have new... Oh, we do have new boobies. Look at those. Look at our new boobies that we get. <laughs> our bloodless boobies. There we go. <laughs> I love that these things just like <laughs> why why do we <laughs> why the boobs it's just it's just outlining the boobs love it we're getting <laughs> well <laughs> anyhow okay so <laughs> thank you so so much for watching I hope you enjoyed today's uh, episode and in the next one we're gonna talk to a starian again um, see if we have new dialogue because he did talk to us about Kazador, so maybe we can now talk about Kazador. Um, what else? Oh, oh, we're gonna look at the um, Buckbear Ogre scene, and we're gonna get the Necromancy of Ty, if the time limit allows us to. But still, thank you so so much, and until the next one, bye bye.